This educational video will explain the normal process of digestion, the laparoscopic adjustable gastric band procedure, and how weight loss will occur upon completion of the surgery. Currently, your stomach can hold about 40 ounces of food. Once in your stomach, the food combines with digestive juices containing acids and enzymes that help break it down into smaller particles. Once broken down, the small particles are slowly released into the first part of your small intestine, the duodenum, by a muscle called the pyloric valve. The pyloric valve is a ring of muscle between your stomach and your duodenum. Most of the nutrients from the broken down food are absorbed in the duodenum and the jejunum, which is the second part of the small intestine. The steps in the laparoscopic adjustable gastric banding procedure, also referred to as LAGB, involve placing an inflatable band around the stomach, stitching both sides of the stomach around the band to secure the band in place, and inserting a port underneath the skin. Your surgeon will place the adjustable gastric band into the body through a cannula, which is a hollow tube inserted in your abdomen during surgery. Once inside the abdominal cavity, your surgeon will pass the band behind the back of the stomach near the top area where the esophagus connects to the stomach. This part of the stomach is known as the gastric pouch and has the capacity to hold one to two ounces of food. Your surgeon will then lock the band into position by threading one end of the tube through the hole on the other end of the band. Your surgeon will secure the band by stitching the part of the stomach that is directly below the band, called the fundus, to the part of the stomach just above the band. These permanent stitches prevent the band from slipping. After the band is secure around your stomach, the remaining part of the tube is pulled through a cannula, so the end of the tube is outside your abdominal cavity. Finally, the surgeon attaches a port to the tube and secures it to a layer of muscle on top of the abdomen but beneath the skin. After surgery, the port allows your surgeon to adjust the constriction of the lap band by injecting a liquid into the port which travels to the band and inflates it. Weight loss occurs because after surgery you will be very restricted in the quantity of food you can eat before feeling full.